Jay-Z Swatch Game is one of a kind. No, literally, a T. Beyonce Sir Davis whiskey launch in Paris. Jay-Z couldn't help but flex his cash status that much more than the other stars present. Baller Alert recently reported on the one-of-a-kind Richard Mill watch that he wore to the event, which is worth $3 million. It's an RM66 Flying Turbillion in red-orange sapphire, a model dedicated to rock and roll thanks to its depiction of a gold human skeleton hand forming the horns gesture. It's HOV's third commission piece from Richard Mill following his two custom RM models in blue and green sapphire, respectively. Neck and wrist don't lie. As for those previous watches, Jay-Z rocked the Richard Mill 56-01 Turbillion Green Sapphire and his Richard Mill 056, the blueprint. He's an avid timekeeper fanatic, a true luxury chronometry nerd, and whatever other fancy words you can come up with to describe an obsession with tiny wrist clocks. We see an 8 say we blame the New York legend. But he has other financial matters to attend to. Dame Dash's auction of his Reasonable Doubt shares continues to be a contentious battle within the Rock and with the city of New York. However, according to one Jaguar Wright, Jay-Z should one day sell these watches to cover settlement payments and legal fees. She's been very vocally advocating for the acknowledgement of his alleged crimes, making Diddy-associated claims against him and calling him out for his silence amid that scandal. While these are all just allegations at the end of the day, it doesn't deter other folks from wanting some form of address from the Rock Nation boss, as for Sean Combs' various allegations and federal case. Meanwhile, another issue that Jay-Z remains quite tight-lipped about is this whole Super Bowl halftime show controversy. Does he have the sole say in who gets the headlining spot or not? Should Lil Wayne have headlined next year's event in New Orleans instead of Kendrick Lamar? The takes are endless. Maybe it's only a matter of time before Jay pops out with a public statement of any kind. He should probably check his $3 million flying turbillion to follow up on that.